Hi again guys, it's another Gran Turismo 6 tuning video for you today and this time it's for the Dodge Viper SRT10 ACR model the track based version so you want your racing soft tyres as always as far as suspension we've got the ride height moderate on 90 front and rear rounded off the spring rates to uh, 1175 and 1285 dampers and anti-roll on 4 camber on 1 as usual and neutral toe so it's not dragging its tyres. As far as the gearbox, auto setting as high as possible and final drive of 2.9. As far as the diff, same as always, low initial torque, high acceleration and low braking. You want all the power upgrades obviously and I would always recommend NOS if you can afford it. Unfortunately you can't adjust the downforce but uh, you want weight loss obviously. Traction control turned off because it makes the car quicker and uh, yeah, let's see what it can do so all of the Vipers on Gran Turismo are very quick um, I believe the ACR used to be the fastest version when the game first came out in December um, but uh, Polyphony quickly patched it to uh, slow down the ACR because I believe back then the Vipers or people were getting the Vipers to put out around 15 or 1600 brake horsepower, something stupid like that, and uh, achieving top speeds of like 350, 360 miles per hour without slipstream. Which, you know, that would have been cool if it could still do that, but I think it is good that they, they patched it. Because that is completely unrealistic. I mean, the speed I'm doing at the moment is unrealistic, but. 350 is just ridiculous so uh, this car has a, a cruising speed of 293 so it's about the same as the um, the GTS model Viper um, to be honest most of the Vipers tend to have very similar performance regardless of their uh, model uh, year or specification the only Viper which is really the exception to that is the uh, standard SRT10, the ragtop version, which does pretty much 300 on its own, um, and that model being the fastest one. So yeah, hope this tune setup helps, and uh, as always, thanks for watching.